So then I stayed in the uh, hotel on the um, Tuesday marketplace and uh, looked out onto the silos and then that's the spire of that other church. You know, the one at the far end, St Nicholas. Nicholas. And then uh, we've got, what else have we got? Up? Not much else here. And then that's only today. So that's oh, just now. That was over there looking at you lot. Yeah. But you get this wonderful sort of cascade. But it's all there to be enjoyed. Anyway, it's all very nice. Newcastle itself comes up. There's a warehouse about to knock down in Newcastle. Had this quite nice porch. And then this is Newcastle, which has got great. Do you, wow. you know Newcastle? Yeah, you? quite well, yeah. It's got this great yeah. thing with bridges. Actually, you know, here, look at the shape of all of this. It's funny, isn't it, the sort of quality of them. And actually, all of these drawings, the only reason for doing drawings is that, I mean, when you look at the drawings that you've got here, they just trigger memories of the place. It's not whether anybody says that's a good drawing or bad drawing. It's, it's that you looked at it, you noticed it, and then when you look at it again, you think, actually, you know, that, that's, that's a moment in your time. I love this view. I love this view because I love the way that this street curves around a corner. Yeah. Uh, don't look at the way that the angles of those houses just jolts around. And isn't that a street you just long to walk down? Yeah. You know, what's around the corner? It goes back to being, you know, a child again. You know, what's around the corner? I also love the chimney stacks, the way that they cut against the sky. I adore that little bay window. Isn't that nice? It is nice. And isn't that a street you just long to walk down? Mm. I always draw from left to right. Other people draw differently, but I always draw from left to right. So my first line is always in the upper left corner. So that line is, for me, is that edge of this building here. Now, we've got a roof line. A lovely bow in it, so forgiving. And then that line going across there. So we're beginning, we're beginning, it's beginning to take shape, isn't it? It's really, really nice. Yeah, it's a nice, a nice place, Finsley. Lots of old buildings. Had you drawn much before this? Since school, not at all. Really? No, not at all. <laughs> Fairly good and interested in it at school. Yeah. But not. I hadn't had the time. So Discovered women, got married, got a mortgage, and didn't have the time. This is me, Ron, and. A sketch of myself done in a mirror, which is a reflection of me. This is a courtyard. I'm not sure how the, where this one is. Throsbury or Throsbury. It was a college, wasn't it? There, sh there was a tree here, or there is a tree, but I had to eliminate that tree. This is the Duke's Head, again in King's Lynn. It was harder to, to, to draw it than to build it. <laughs> <laughs> it's our war memorial in St. James's Gardens, and this is our library around the background, in the background. This has probably taken me about nearly three hours or more, yeah. yeah. And, you know, you just do it. The plants start growing, <laughs> that's how long it took. When I was drawing uh, the War Memorial stand, when I was sketching that, this is behind me, this was behind me, so, and I drew that, and that was off a, a print, mm. a photocopy. And it does actually lean like that. Yes, this is the minister. I drew this from standing there. Yeah, I can draw something just in my bed, nothing on TV, knock that off, put my knees up, put my pad there, and just draw something. Shut, close my eyes for a moment, and then think of the place, the spot, where I'm thinking, and then open my eyes and then start drawing. It's the fountain in St. James's Walks. It's a nice spot. It's um, 
I'm, that's when I'm on the way to my doctors. I sit there under that tree and there's a lovely tree. There was one winter when it froze over and it was lovely. I draw this from memory. West Lynn, that is. The river is probably a quarter of a half, quarter of a mile wide, the river is. Well, I'm a fisherman and I do like, I'm drawn to the seas. Ah, the majestic cinema, beautiful place. That is really beautiful. It's, it's, it's even more beautiful inside. Oh, the decor, the, the ceilings, the, the coving. The town hall, or part of it, it's bigger than this. It's hard, very hard. Um, it's got so much decorative work. I'm pleased with them. That's quite interesting, yeah. First time I've ever drawn something like that. Yeah, I have improved, yes, yeah. Confident, so they've even told me that perfectly what I've shown them, you know. That's the market's place just out there across the, across the road. That bit was the hardest, sort of, you know. That was quite awkward, that one. You know, trying to get everything in, you know, at a certain scale. But that's the TSP bank. That one, that TSB bank, where people keep walking through, you know. Um, oh, that's the old customs house, isn't it? That was a bit awkward, you know, sort of getting getting everything right, you know. That's white flies entrance to up near the South Key, isn't it? I think that's a sort of near beyond my sister live, I think, isn't it? Yeah. I quite enjoyed doing that one. That's good. How do you find drawing in pen? I don't know, it's different, isn't it? I don't know what's best, uh, you know, pencil. Pencil, you can rub it out, can't you? Yeah, I felt after a while, yeah, I thought, I hope I made a mistake, I can't rub it out. <laughs> That one I drew from at home, but yeah, sort of went right up into. I mean, you look right across the well, some of the park, a fair way across. That was the hardest, probably the hardest one I've done. It's just it was a certain scale, you know. Done it out of the out of a book, you know, not sitting right opposite, you know. Just, you know, the, the windows are easy. It's just sort of the roof bit was a hard, and then the tree bit. Yeah. Quite like going to football. You know, I used to go there a lot, a long time ago. Started going again last year, or this year. We used to be sort of in this corner. If it was chucking down, we used to go sort of under here. It's under cover here. Right. That's all open. But if you you can pay an extra pound to sit, sit up in the grandstand. That's the old post office uh, opposite Argus. It's the old court shop up just up the street there. <laughs> I've never walked through this bit before, you know. The only bit I used to go through is where the shops are, you know, I used to go shopping. That was awkward, because there's so much detail in it, it too. That was, that was awkward, was just getting that bit in, the window bit in, you know. I'm happy, yeah. You know. Had you drawn much before? No, I've never drawn in my life, only light stick people. I could not draw to save my life. They're not that brilliant, I don't think, but I'm making an effort to do something. I think I'm just proud of what I've done. We went to Thornsby College, and we sat out there, and it was really nice, and I decided to draw one of the buildings in the, in the grounds. Very hard, because of all the different windows, and... Uh, we went for a walk onto the Tuesday Marketplace, and I decided to draw the Duke's head. That was really hard, because there's so many windows, and stuff in there. It took a bit of working out to get the shape of the building. The Marriott's at the back of the, the quay where I live, not far from where I live. I just thought it was so, such an unusual building. It must have been an old worker warehouse years ago and they like turned it into this restaurant. It was just different. Oh, this is just like all the um, decorated the bits on the walls and the flower beds and the arms house, yeah, I think that is really unusual. Um, but I've never been in there. That's another thing I'd like to go and knock on someone's door and just have a look inside. I'm nosy, I just like to have a look. I love old buildings. Yeah, this is the arm house, it's scaled down. That was difficult trying to get it into such a small piece of square. Um, that's the south gates, which I've never ever been up because I don't like heights.
Oh, uh, that's the library. That's just got so many old features. That is a beautiful building, that library. I've just never seen so much unusual brickwork on it. Oh, the bit, the Ritz Bingo Hall. It used to be an old um, cinema. Uh, it's the old Courts furniture shop. It's so um, run down because that bit's the roof that's that's rotten. The, the art centre. Um, I just like the basic layout of it, and the windows were so unusual as well, especially this one here. I've never been in the art centre. There's a lot of things I've never been in since I've been living here. Oh, I love it. It's better than living where I used to live. Oh, the town hall was so hard to draw. It's getting the shape of it right in the middle of for the middle part. That was from live. I've done that without any pictures. When Did we sit out sitting outside. Now I'm getting a bit of confidence to draw to draw it. Of drawing. It just seems I'm getting better and better every week I do it. And I want to continue doing it when this course is this is finished. Just something to pass the time away. Especially when you're on your own, you just get a bit depressed when you want something to do. That's good, Karen. It is good, isn't it? Not bad. Yeah. <coughs> I have to enjoyed it, yes. Yeah, so several weeks we've been here, yeah. Something to do, you know, on the picture, yeah. That is lovely. Mm. It is difficult to take your mind off everything. Um, you do need patience and you do need concentration. I don't know if I'll be getting any better. No, very good. And then you've got, obviously that gives it away, doesn't it? No, Just it's over changed. the road here. Yeah, lovely. No, it's very Isn't nice. It's marvellous. Excellent. Excellent. I, um, yeah, it's an achievement. <laughs> I didn't really realise I had this ability. I mean, it's, it, it's good. I could go out the street and do it. I'm happy, yeah, I'm very happy. Uh, How are you getting on, Kelvin? Right. I'm one of these, I can't sit still for five minutes. I've got to be doing something. You... I'm really proud of myself now. I'm proud, more than proud, I'm, uh, I'm shocked. I'm, I'm actually surprised that I could sit down and, and do something like this. You know, talents that I didn't think I had. <laughs> Oh, Lindsay's cutting and he fell out the window the other bit of the weekend. Oh, yeah. Who's on the phone? Yeah, stupid boy. Oh, yeah.